Hey, Rick. Hey, Megan. How you doing? Did you get kicked out of your house? Yeah, the contractor showed up by the time we're starting our call. So, <laughs> well, it looks like um, can... I hope you had uh, lunch for the contractor and and uh, chocolate covered strawberries, and hopefully they'll <laughs> stay on it and get your kitchen done. Well, I think they're making progress. That's a good thing. I can't wait to see. Okay, so this week we're going to talk about solar panels because. Mm -hmm. They come up every once in a while, and I feel like we need to educate people on what is happening on our side, okay? Yep. All right. So, Rick, as I understand it, there's uh, two different ways to have solar panels on one's home. One is where you, you purchase the solar panels, so you right. don't have a payment to a solar company. Uh, and the other is where someone can lease solar panels mm -hmm. and um, then there's a monthly payment for the solar panels. Correct. Now, um, when somebody leases the solar panels, it's recorded on title as a lease, right? Yep. Yeah. So when you as a lender see a leased solar panel versus a purchased solar panel, what do you have to do with that information? Well, they're kind of similar in terms of a, from a lending perspective, Megan. So if there is a lease, the, the, the new home buyer has to either assume that lease, in other words, assume the payments that go along with that lease. Mm -hmm. And if that's the case, whatever those payments are, those get added as a debt like any other debt the buyer would incur. So mm -hmm. that could impact their qualifying for a loan, depending upon the lease. Okay. Second option with that, of course, is to sell to buy out that lease and just pay it off. Mm -hmm. um, if it's a loan, the seller is obligated for that loan on their credit. And so the really the only thing a seller can do is pay it off mm -hmm. you know, when they sell their home. Um, so the thing with the lease is that um, the seller can't take that with them. Mm -hmm. Right. And it's not something where, uh, the sellers sometimes think, well, if they have a, a solar system that gives a home a lot more value, and we know that that's not the case. Mm -hmm. It's a great, it's a great perk for sure, but it doesn't add a whole lot of value uh, to the house. It's very similar to someone putting in a pool. Well, in terms of value. I, okay, so to go back on that, I'm going to circle back mm -hmm. real quick so people understand mm -hmm. that if they get a leased solar system and they go to sell their house and they don't pay the lease off. The buyer has to assume the lease. And Rick, are you there? Rick. 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 